Listen, man. I wasn't going to do this over the internet. Because at the end of the day, it's pointless. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got your number, you got my number. But I've been reaching out to you. I've been calling you. You ain't been answering the phone. So, the only way I could get your attention or, or, or get, get you to hear or, or listen to my message is through the internet. So, so, so. And then you say, and then you say, um, you say some shit about me winning my fourth world title. Well, I learned this shit from you, right? You told me this out your own mouth. You said, we are inboxing to get the biggest reward for less punishment. That's what you told me. So, for you to go talk about one of my accomplishments and downplay something that I did, that's fucked up when ain't no, ain't no, ain't no TMT fighter got four world championships and four weight classes. Only you. So how the fuck could you downplay some shit that I did? No matter, I don't give a fuck if I fought your assistant for my last fight. I'm still a four-time world champion. I'm at the end of the day when it's all said and done, just like you say, when it's all said and done, I'm going to go in the books, I'm going to go in the history books as a four-time world champion in four different weight classes if I quit boxing today. And then, and then you said some shit like, uh, if I'm disrespecting you, I'm disrespecting Al Heyman. But that's a contradicting ass saying because Al Heyman the one that got me to fucking fight. I ain't go out to pick these motherfuckers. I don't go out to pick these motherfuckers. I don't know these motherfuckers from Russia. I don't know them. I ain't never heard of him. Um, so with you saying that, that that you wouldn't you you would be ashamed. You you wouldn't call yourself a world champion. Um, you the one disrespecting Al Heyman. And you said, if I'm disrespecting Al Heyman, I'm disrespecting you. So you disrespecting yourself, nigga. How you want somebody to respect you and you disrespect yourself? Come on, Floyd. This shit lame, bro. Pick up your phone and call me. What you did wasn't no player shit. That wasn't... That wasn't no live shit. That was some lame fuckboy shit. Like, you went on the internet and sent out a message talking about somebody that you put on record as your little brother. You know what I'm saying? Somebody that you say you love and you 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 care for and 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 want to look after them and all this one shit. And then you 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 try to diss them to the public. That ain't no cool shit. Um, and don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. I I probably said that bullshit. I could have I could have said that bullshit that I said in a different way. But everybody know, and you know, cause we talked about this on the phone before you put this weak ass diss out. I wasn't talking about you. I will never disrespect you. Um, cause when it come to boxing, you amazing. You know, it it might not never be another Floyd Mayweather. It might not never be another motherfucker that 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 that, that, that take the game on and do it how you did it. But at the end of the day, as a person, you fucked up, man. You fucked up for real. You 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 falling out. You falling out with, with with some of the realest niggas that you got around you. Like, come on, man. At the end of the day, 
all I wanted from you is to teach me how to do what you did or even surpass what you did. That's all I wanted from you. I don't that's that that's it. I can go out here and make my own money. I can go out here and buy my own cars. You know what I'm saying? That's all I want for I just want to learn from you. All that other shit is weak, man. Like And then like you you making it so personal like I'm fighting you. Nigga, I ain't fighting you. You ain't say shit about me fighting Ashley Thiel Pain. You went on a, you went on a diss like you that much in your feelings. Nigga, quit playing with me, man. Come on, man. Quiet is kept. You only fuck with a, a couple of them TMT fighters. You don't even fuck with them for real, man. You want me to be TMT, nigga. Quit playing with me, man. Nigga. And, and it is what it is. I don't fuck with none of them niggas, man. I fuck with you. And like you told me on the phone, nigga. Everything cool. Fuck everybody if, if, if me and you cool, right? So what the fuck was that, that weak-ass message for, Floyd? And then I just feel like, you know, you way bigger than that. Why would you make a message to to little old Adrian Bronner, man? Am I that important to you, Floyd? Like, like was that really on your mind when you woke up to? To wake up and call Ben from Fight Hype and make a diss about Adrian Bronner and put it out. And then you told me to grow up. Nigga, you got some fucking growing up to do. And you older than me. I wouldn't do, man, come on, man. I never put out a diss and, and, and diss Floyd Mayweather. And now I, let, and now I never let nobody in my camp this Floyd Mayweather. Even today, nigga. After the diss, nigga. I don't play that shit. I'm a real nigga. Point blank period. And I ain't gotta say that. That shit you did was weak. That was some... That was some gay ass shit. For real. And then... You gonna bring up the... The Bruce Jenner shit. Come on, man. Quit playing with me, Floyd. Floyd, quit playing with me, bro. When have you ever gave a fuck about it? You know what? I ain't even gonna go into that. You know you was wrong for that, though. And... And for anybody out there, I have... I have... I have no problems with... With, 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 with gay, gay men or, or gay women, I have no, no problems with the homosexuality out there. Um, it was just, you know, when I do my interviews, I don't, I don't, pre I don't prepare or, or write nothing down. It was just off the top, like suicide, and you know, that's what I felt. That's just how I felt at the moment, you know, but, um, you know, back to, back to the situation, man. I'm, I'm a hundred percent supportive of TMT. I want to see any boxer out of TMT be successful and be become a, a world champion one day. If not already a world champion, um, Because, not only because, you know, he got a lot of African Americans on his team, but he got a lot of people on his team that grew up how I grew up. And and I, I want anybody that grew up from the hood or, 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 or without, a, without a silver spoon, you know, I want them to make it, you know. And that's all I'm saying, man. But, but it's a, it's a, it's a lot of hate coming from over your way, man. And I don't like it. And, and I'm, and I'm real mad that, that you really, you really made me 
stoop down to this level. Because at the end of the day, man, we both bigger than this bullshit, bro. We make too much money for this bullshit. I don't, I don't make near as much money as you yet. But at the end of the day, we make too much money for this childish ass shit, man. Quit playing, man. Pick up your motherfucking phone. You got my number. Come on, man. Hit me up, bro. If you want to talk business, we can talk business. This shit was weak, bro. Some gay ass shit. For real. If ain't nobody else gonna tell you, I'm gonna tell you. Because I ain't no yes man, nigga. That was some gay ass shit. Real talk. Hit up your little brother. AB. Four time world champion, nigga. Four different weight classes, nigga. Yeah. Fuck out of here.